Uh uh. Yo, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. Chess vs. Calico. I figure we talk about this because I see so many different people with varying opinions and things like that when they speak about Calico's battle. And I just, like, y'all got to stop minimizing Calico's win. First of all, Calico won this battle clearly. 2 1, if not 3 0. Honestly, I'm more so leaning towards the side of 3 0. And here's the reason why. Calico showed up prepared. Calico showed up with direct material. He was able to break down Chess in every single magnitude. Now, you know, Chess in his first round, he chokes, he throws up, he leaves the stage, and he's gone for a couple minutes throwing up. And then he comes back, and he gets into material. He has material, he's bombing, he's doing what he's doing. But it's all negated by the fact that he threw up, period. Like, he threw up in the middle of his first round. He gets through it. He does a second round. His second round was good. His third round, he does it again, and they, like, edited it out. And you're moving the goalposts because, and I, I, rock, I love what Chess does when he's on a high level. I recap this easy to block captain battle, uh, all of the other ones that he's been elevating and doing his thing. But, bro. We cannot be doing this. We not gonna be, there's people out there that feel like he won 2-1, how? Like, how? I would love to know how. The comment section is there for you and it's available. You can't be like, he won this battle, bro. And I don't care about the narrative or what this person is saying or that person is saying, I got my own channel. Fuck that, 75,000 subscribers, I got my own channel, I got my own voice, I say what I want, period. But we not gonna sit here and act like you know, oh, it's cool, he threw up, he got it, and then there's the people out there that's like, oh, it's maybe it's anxiety, or maybe it's acid reef. Listen, fam, you know, there's people with GERD, there's people that's acid reflux, and they, people are trying to figure out what causes it and things. Bro, it's a rap battle. You show up, you rap, you leave. If he does not get through his rounds, he does not win the battle. It does not matter. Like, we're not... I don't even care to figure out what was this and why did this happen and why that. I don't, I was looking when that stream is on from 5 to 9 or from 6 to 11, you know, sometimes it's just be running long as fucking long ass intermissions and shit. It, that's what you're there to do. You're there to show up, you're there to rap and get paid and go home. That's it. If you can't get through your material, you don't win the battle. Period. That's not it. Like, we can't. We can't do that. We can't make up excuses. You know what I mean? Because if Cal would have did the same thing, y'all would have killed him. And I made a tweet earlier in the week that said, they're not giving Cal the same energy they would have gave him if he lost. Or, you know what I'm saying? Like the win. They're not talking about Calico's win loud enough. And it's maybe, I don't know if it's because he's from the Midwest. I don't know if because he paints himself as a villain. I don't know if he always talks about because he's getting paid this money, he's getting his bag. You know, I don't know if he's because he marches to the beat of his own drum. Whatever the case may be, y'all gotta stop that, bro. We cannot do this. It don't matter who it is, bro. Like, there's no exceptions. If somebody wins, they win. If they don't, they don't. You know? I would love to see a point where Chess gets whatever he's got going on under control and he could get through his rounds and get through his battles. But if he doesn't get through the battle in more than one round, now if he would have only had that choke throw up situation in the first round, and then he got through the second and the third and clearly bombed on Cal, then yeah, he gets the battle, even with a nasty start. But when you look at his rounds, he kind of like messed himself up in a lot of his rounds. He's talking, like he does this thing like where he said, I don't care if you're super cal or fragilistic espialidocious. And cal is like this, like, what? And then Chess says some shit like, it's different. That means it's different. You can't rap like that. Like, bro, like you doing a, and we know, I know you a high energy battle rapper. But he's talking in between the material. Like, you dumb, you can't. And Cal is messing him up with things like this. He's reaching, right? And as a professional MC that does things on the highest level, Cal knows the little tricks to get in your head, you know what I mean? And he's doing this while Chess is doing super califragile, he's doing his reach thing. And he's like, it's not a reach, it's not a reach, you're explaining yourself. You gotta get, bro, family, you got a problem getting through your material. You can't be explaining to the nigga, you can't be explaining to him 
why the material is what it is, why I'm a better rapper, and why he's doing this. He's reaching, he's reaching, he's doing all of this shit. And Khaled tricked you right out of your game. That's exactly what he did. He tricked you right out of your game. And you talking to him, and you all in his face, and you, you, you literally threw up, and now you in his face, and now you barking, and now you arguing. It's like, bro, calm down, my nigga. Like, if you would have literally said, you know what, I had this fuck up. And then, another thing is, People trying to even give him the first round. I'm like, how are you going to give him the first round when in his own first round, out of his own voice, he's saying this. You lucky I effed up in that first. I'm going to violate you in the second and third. This man just said he lost a round himself. You cannot love a person so much that they could say they lost a round and you saying that they won. How? Explain that to me. How can, you, how can we love an MC so much that they could say they lost the first round and you still say that they won? I'm lost with that one. I, 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 if I'd heard everything, I did not know that, that this was even possible. I don't even know why we're having this conversation, but this has to end. Like, y'all don't give Verb no passes. Y'all don't give Calico no passes. Y'all don't give Danny Myers no passes. Danny messed up in one battle in a 52 week span of smoking niggas and they destroyed him. He got, he got killed after that real sick battle. But we got, if, uh, if Danny Myers left the stage for like, two, that was a long ass intermission. Like he left and came back, bro. Like I'm out of here. I see y'all niggas, he could have walked to his car and came back. You know, and I get it. You know, people say, oh, the health, you know, I get it. Yeah, health is important. Health is wealth. You know, I don't know if it's anxiety. I don't know if it's uh, acid reflux. I don't know what it is. I just know when he get on that stage, you already know it's coming. And this has been in like mad battles. The only battle that it didn't happen in recent time was he had a couple that he got through. You know what I'm saying? He got through the Loso joint. He got through the um, Kid Chaos joint. Uh, he got through the Easy joint. Whatever preparation you did before the Easy battle, that's what you need to do every fucking battle. You need to come like that every joint. Like I don't know what is the diet. I don't know what what you was eating. I don't know what you but but you was only drinking water on stage. So people's like, oh, he shouldn't be drinking. He he don't he doesn't strike me as somebody who be drinking like liquor. He never I never hear I never seen Chess drink alcohol a day in my life at no battle or none of that shit. And he you know when niggas be on stage they be sipping handy and they be doing, he don't be doing that. So he he he, he doesn't get through the material. And you're like, oh, he's young. He is young. He's 23. But at the same time, this Calico battle is his biggest battle. One of the biggest, you know, the Loaded Hollows was probably the biggest, uh, but it's one of the biggest looks for him. And Calico got through that. He won clearly every round. I'm not, you can't do simple, because this nigga Calico literally, he wrote so well that when he was talking about the nigga, he said we had a parlay on him throwing up, you know what I'm saying? He said, you never, I didn't throw up on my first break. I ain't throw up on my first lick. I ain't throw up on my first bitch. Matter of fact, I told her to take the kids. Like, he's writing personally to you. I must be really dreaming. How they got me up here on any given Sunday battling against Willie Beeman. Like, my nigga, that is oh, perfect counter writing to anything. I get it. Chess had moments. Yes, he does. He always, when is Chess not going to have moments? You know? It was crazy because... He's been battling not just the throwing up and shit like that. He was battling, stumbling, choking through his rounds at one point, too. He gets past that. He didn't do that. He was not choking. He was not stumbling all through his shit. But he couldn't get it out. He could not get the material out. And I just felt like he was mad hype. Like, he was just way too hype. Chess has good energy. His energy is fire, but sometimes it's OD. And when Cal is talking, Cal was literally on Chess is rapping. He's like, yo, this nigga's fucking me up. And the stick rise up there. Like, bro, you got to, you got to rap. You got to rap. When you down like that, you down like that, you can't be losing by 25 points with in the fourth quarter and you going to the you driving to the lane on a fast break and you throw the ball between your legs and nah, nigga, they don't. You, you throwing it off the backboard. You are losing. The prime objective is to win. You have to try to come back and win. And y'all got to, like, bro, we can't. Shaking my head, my nigga. Shaking my head, bro. Like, bro, y'all niggas be tripping, son. I know y'all niggas is fans. I know y'all niggas be probably want people to at y'all or retweet y'all and shit like that. But, bro, Cal won this battle clear. This is the clearest battle Calico has won in a very long time. Nah, and he, you know, he has debatables in some joints, he wins some joints, some joints you might feel like he lost. But this one right here, there's nothing to debate. Like, 
when I do, when me and Showtime SP do go to break down a card and all of that, this is not a battle that I'm putting a lot of energy into. I'm not. I will not. He won. Clear. And if the situation would have, if, if we switch to MCs and Calico is him and Chess is him, same scenario, where Chess gets through all of his material flawlessly and Cal is choking and got to go off the stage and throw, y'all niggas would have said he got body. Please stop. Y'all would have said he got body. That's what y'all would have said. Y'all would have said he got, Cal got body, destroyed, murdered. Y'all would say he got bodied and killed in 30 versus serve. And he had one little blip in the third round. He missed the one word. He, he was rapping, he got the one word and he slipped up. And y'all niggas were, oh, 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 boo, boo in this lane. Come on, son. Y'all niggas like, I call like y'all call. I see, I can't spoil it, man. In order to keep it a bug, you gotta be honest. You cannot be honest. By, by saying a nigga won a battle that he didn't win. I'm sorry, I, it's just not working like that. We not about to do that. We not about to do that. We not about to do that. And I'm out. Y'all stay out. One.